Hi, my name is Project Sedan. Welcome to Tipbusters. Every week we'll take a look at a new betting strategy, test it out and see if it really works and if it really delivers betting profit. The first betting strategy we've taken a look at is under 4.5 goals. This strategy is quite simple. It works on the premise that there are very rarely football matches with five or more goals in. So you bet on under 4.5 goals to win the bets. Now it's worth noting that not every bookie will offer this market. Some will only go up to three and a half. But with Pro Tip Star, we have 4.5 so we can test it properly. Now the odds on these bets are normally very low. Uh, sometimes as low as 1.05, 1.06. So this is a volume strategy. What that means is it's the kind of strategy where you put on a lot of bets to make a small profit from a high volume. Hit rate is key here because you need a very high hit rate to make a profit. To test out this betting strategy, we opened an account on ProTipster. And with that account, we posted tips that were solely under 4.5 goals on leagues across the world. We did this so that we could test if this strategy worked on all leagues or just some leagues and to get a bit of variation in the odds that were on offer. The overall result of this test was failure. Uh, the reason for this is quite simple. With over 300 tips posted, the yield was negative, about minus 5%. Well, this was because while the hit rate is really high in the high 80s, the average odds was only 1.1, 1.12, 1.15. And therefore, the hit rate was not high enough to counteract the occasional losers that we got. We also tried this strategy out with coupons or accumulators. We put five tips in each accumulator uh, to see if we can make a profit from multi-bets. Unfortunately, this didn't work either. Out of 32 coupons posted, only 12 won. And because of that, and the average odds again being less than two, we made no profit. While this strategy hasn't worked overall, there is a possibility it might work with refinement. For example, one of the most successful tournaments we posted tips in was the UEFA Champions League. Now, the reason for this was because there was a multitude of matches where the bookmakers expected there to be high scoring affairs. For example, Barcelona against the Olympiacos, Liverpool against Maribor, and these matches never ended in high scoring affairs, so the bet came in. The odds were significantly higher, 1.4, 1.5, 1.6. So from Champions League matches, we actually made a profit. Therefore, the trick with this strategy is to look for the leagues where you've got a decent average odds, so 1.2, 1.3 maybe, and you can get enough right so that you can make a profit from those average odds. Now, this is one of the beautiful things about Pro Tips is that you can try this out without actually spending any money. You post the tips, you check the stats, you pull the tape to see what happens. And we can refine stats by team, we can refine stats by league, by tournaments. So you can see how well you've done, not only, not only overall, but also in the individual tournaments. And if you can find an individual tournament where you can consistently make a positive yield, then presto, you've got a winning betting strategy. The overall result was failure. With over 300 tips posted, we have a negative yield of around minus 5%. The reason for this is that although our hit rate is high at 85%, the average odds is so low, 1.13, that every miss costs too much. We can take a look at some of the tips here so you can see just how well they've performed. We've got a couple outstanding. And you can see the odds, 1.07, 1.06, 1.11, and whilst many of these have won, every so often you'll see one that doesn't. Ironically there, Ireland versus Denmark didn't win. <coughs> and every time one of those drops, it kills the yield. Likewise, with coupons, we also failed. Of the 32 coupons we posted, only 12 won. As you can see, when I bring up the coupons, the average value of each coupon was very low as well, around 1.4, something like that, which meant that, again, every miss, every time we dropped a coupon, it cost too much. There were a couple of good winners. Uh, if I scroll down, you can see this one here came in at 2.59. Um, this is because many of these games, there was a, a large amount of goals expected by the bookmakers, and it didn't happen. 
this is when uh, you can make money from this sort of thing but too, all too often the odds are too low one of the most successful tournaments who posted these tips in was the UEFA Champions League this is because the bookmakers were expecting many big wins for teams in what looked pre-game like horrendous mismatches so games like Barcelona against Olympiacos like uh, Borussia Dortmund against Apoel Nicosia like Liverpool against Maribor and these didn't come to fruition so as you can see um, our yield was 7.1% from 16 tips and our average odds was actually quite high 1.25 the other tournaments we were profitable in was because we had a hit rate of 100% so we're going to be profitable you can check all the tips and coupons we posted using this strategy in the links in the description below this video and you can see for yourself what we did and how it worked you can also check uh, the thousands of other tips that are posted in six different sports on ProTipster every day and maybe use them to improve your betting profit. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to get more advice on betting strategies in addition to daily tips, podcasts and even my diaries to help you improve your betting profits. Thanks for watching. Good luck.